Olive Branch Arts are an arts-based uh, company. They work with theatre originally. They started working with drama therapy and theatre based in the UK, working with schools on uh, issues such as knife crime, um, domestic violence, healthy relationships, that kind of thing with young people in secondary schools in the UK. So I started working with Olive Branch in 2012 and David and Becky initially got me involved purely to document their work out there and the life on the camps. So I did that from 2012 and in 2014 we published a book of my photography and collected traditional poems and sayings from the community. In October 2017, I went out and ran my first participatory photography training program in the Sahara. We worked with uh, 11 young refugees from the ages of 17 to maybe 32. My favourite photograph changes. Uh, currently, it's the one that was taken by one of our participants called Salka, who's just 18 years old uh, and it's a picture of one of her friends and her mouth fur and her headscarf are blowing in the wind we can't see this young woman's face but for me it completely encapsulates the idea of freedom we'd like people to come and see the exhibition and just walk away with uh, an understanding of who this community is. A lot of people haven't heard of them. They're the last colony in Africa. They're called the Forgotten People. So just to spread the knowledge of who they are, what their story is, is a great start. And then if that prompts people to get involved, either with Olive Branch Arts or any of the other organisations in the UK who work with the Western Sahara community, that would be amazing.